Hey everyone, Ben from Motive here to bring you a video on the first setup of PI Plus on your Reflex Plus. So I guess first to start off with, what is PI Plus? PI Plus is an advanced feature that works alongside with your Reflex Plus and MHD. This allows your tuner to make changes to the Reflex and Reflex calibration all through just the MHD map. So the benefit to you is all you have to do after this initial setup I'm going to bring you through is just flash the map that your tuner sends and you're good to go dialing you in faster than ever before. So let's jump right in and grabbing the files that we're going to need. So we'll head over to the Motive web page. We'll go over to support and then downloads. So two things that we're going to want to grab is the firmware bootloader application. And then we're going to want to grab the PI plus files. Just download the whole zip. To do that, we can head over there and we're going to extract these files. Great. All right, that's all we need from there. Now, of course, this is assuming that you have Tuner Pro RT already installed on the computer. Um, if you need any help with installation or configuration, go ahead and check out our first setup video. All right, so as far as the condition of the vehicle right now, we currently have ignition off. USB is plugged into the reflex. And we're going to go ahead and update the firmware first. So open up the bootloader application. Now we're going to go ahead and turn ignition on. So with your G-Series vehicle, you're going to want to press the start stop button three times quickly within about a second and a half on uh, no foot on the brake. And you should see diagnostic mode appear on the dash. Once we do that, we'll see that it has anchored. So we're going to go ahead and import the firmware file. Now that firmware file is where we extracted the MHD plus uh, PI control. And now you're going to want to take reference to the serial number range. This is very important because you have to have the correct serial number range for the serial number of your reflex because the firmware is slightly different. Um, now, if you do flash the wrong firmware, totally fine. We made it to just where you could just flash the correct one and you're good to go. An identification of this happening is if you go ahead and launch Tuner Pro and it just doesn't connect. So my reflex serial number is in the 6000s. So I'm going to select this one here. And we're going to go ahead and update. Only takes a few seconds. All right, now we're done. So really important, do not turn the ignition off at this time. All you're going to do is unplug the USB from the reflex for two to five seconds. Hear that auditory confirmation. And then we'll just plug it back in. And we can just close the bootloader application. Now we're going to head over to Tuner Pro RT. We heard the auditory confirmation that Windows has connected to it and Tuner Pro is connected to your reflex. You'll also see down at the bottom, of course, the device you have connected and the current firmware. Once we do this, super simple, um, but we're going to go ahead and go over the settings. So we're going to go to tools and then preferences, data acquisition, emulation, configure plugin component, and you always want to switch at the shared with emulator. And then just for PI plus, all we have to do is open the bin. And that is the map file here. And that again was extracted from the MHD plus PI control zip file that we downloaded. And we sent it. And that is it. We saw the confirmation it was sent and we are good to go. So now from here, all you're going to do is flash your car with MHD from the map that your tuner has provided. Be sure to go ahead, clear codes, power the ignition off, and then back on again. And if you are continuing to see MHD codes 0001 or 0002 for CAN timeout, be sure to go ahead and repeat that process again with going ahead, clearing codes, doing ignition off, and then going ahead and doing ignition on. If you are continuing to see these codes, then that indicates that there's potentially a wiring problem. So re-go over your wiring for the CAN wires to make sure that's connected appropriately. Thank you so much and happy tuning.